Boy. Set to enter the octagon against him, UFC strongweight champion. As she makes her way to the octagon right now, her preparation has been perfect. She is in fantastic shape. She is focused. She is motivated. And she believes she will leave this cage tonight as the new champion of the world. Pretty Boy enters the octagon, ready to go to battle. working her way towards the octagon, where she plans on defending her champ. The champion is making her way to the cage right now. Her preparation for this title bout has been absolutely according to plan. She is focused, she is in great shape, motivated and determined to step in here and put on a championship level performance and retain her title. Police here, set for this strawweight fight. Our tale of the tape for this strawweight championship fight. Pretty Boy is 38. Herrick is 44. Pretty Boy is one inch taller. Herrick will have a two inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. The action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, he was there. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Air Canada Center in Toronto, Canada. This woman is a kickboxer holding professional record of 22 wins, 18 losses. She stands 5 feet 5 inches tall, weighing in at 114 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York, introducing the challenger, Fritty Boy. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding professional record of 30 wins, 4 losses. She stands 5 feet 4 inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, fighting at a Crystal Lake, Illinois, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Felice Little UFC belt on the line, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. Police Harry. You ready? Pretty boy. You ready? And here we go! Our championship fight tonight is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Oh, my. White trunks for pretty boy. Black trunks for the champion. Joe, she's really on point with her strikes tonight. Oh, solid jab. Combination by the champion. Nice shot. Now they're turning it up. <laughs> nice job avoiding the leg kick. Great utilization of the jab. Joe, she's really showcasing her striking skills. Nice punch by Harry. They clinch here early. And separate. Lead right. Nice strike slam. Boom, right on the button. The right hook misses. Good Safe defense. for now. She's back up. Big spinning back fist. Nice hands, really connecting with the punches. Hard right to the body. Mixing it up. Perry caught by that inside leg kick. Oh, she can do damage with this Muay Thai plum clinch. 
Wow! She's down. That shot dropped her. Back up. Oh! Oh! Look at that! Oh my! Looking to finish this fight right here. Oh my! Just like that! Outstanding timing and accuracy for a knockout victory. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. And here we see the stunning KO that retained her title. The shot lands with picture-perfect accuracy. Her opponent goes limp, her arms go up, and she retains her world title. Watch this again here. Oh, man. KO. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has gone to stop for this contest. At one minute, 40 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Felice Lilbuka Harris. And she remains your UFC strawweight champion. Between Felice Heron and Mr. Untouchable. <laughs> Mr. Untouchable, set to enter the octagon again tonight, looking to leap as the new UFC strawweight champion. As she makes her way to the octagon right now, her preparation has been perfect. She is in fantastic shape, she is focused, she is motivated, and she believes she will leave this cage tonight as the new champion of the world. Mr. Untouchable enters the octagon with one goal, leaving as the champion.
champion is making her way to the cage right now. Her preparation for this title bout has been absolutely according to plan. She is focused, she is in great shape, motivated and determined to step in here and put on a championship level performance and retain her title. Please, Harry, set to fight Mr. Untouchable. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Mr. Untouchable is 37. Herrick is 45. She will have a three-inch reach advantage. And with the official introductions, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Pergliotta. They touch. Felice Harry. You ready? Mr. You ready? Untouchable. Here go. we go! Today's main event of the evening is scheduled for five. Five minute rounds. Great job landing a series of punches. Good Safe defense for now. Back up. Kick early by the champion. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh, big right hand! Oh! Beautiful body wow. shot there, too. Oh! Wow, and she's down again. Wow! Unbelievable! Oh. Big straight punch. Teeing away. Big takedown. Wow. Strong jab. Oh, good combination. Hard jab. Turning into an all out slug fest. That's a huge punch. Punch. Vicious combinations. Big elbow. elbow. Connects Man. with a straight right hand. Kick to the head lands. Hard straight punch. Nasty combinations here. Huge kick. Damaging left, left hand. hand. Oh, oh, that's a vicious elbow. elbow. Oh. Oh. Powerful left hand. Oh, big elbow. Oh, look at it. Accuracy on the right hand for the victory. 
Let's see it one more time. Look at the power in this hook as it lands for the knockout. Check it out here. Bam! And good night. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliante has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute 54 seconds in the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undefeated UFC strongweight champion of the world, Felice Lampuka Harris. And she remains the UFC strawweight champion. As she makes her way to the Octagon right now, her preparation has been perfect. She is in fantastic shape, she is focused, she is motivated, and she believes she will leave this cage tonight as the new champion of the world. The Apex steps into the Octagon, looking to become the new UFC champion. championship belt. The champion is making her way to the cage right now. Her preparation for this title bout has been absolutely according to plan. She is focused, she is in great shape, motivated and determined to step in here and put on a championship level performance and retain her title. Police here, ready to defend her UFC strawweight title. Our tale of the tape for this strawweight championship fight. The Apex is 25. Herrick is 45. The Apex is one inch taller. 
she will have a three inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge, Herb Dean. This is the moment U.S. fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Sold Out Arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Strawweight Championship of the World. This woman is a kickboxer, holding professional record of 11 wins, 2 losses. She stands 5 feet 5 inches tall, weighing in at 110 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, introducing the challenger, the Apex. And now introducing the champion, fighting at the red corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 32 wins, 4 losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, fighting at a Crystal Lake, Illinois, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Felice Lil Bulldog Rises for the championship. If you give me your instructions in the dressing room, protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go down right now. Tonight's championship fight is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for the apex. Black trunks. Oh! She doesn't say this often, but for this fight, she did point out that the training camp was far from ice. Oh! Look at that! Oh, my! She's knocked down! Boom! Big uppercut! Oh! oh. Combination! Hard jab! Wow. Oh. Wow. That's a big hook! First. Time now for our fight replay. And here we see the stunning KO that retained her title. The shot lands with picture perfect accuracy. Her opponent goes limp, her arms go up, and she retains her world title. Take a look at this from a different angle. Bam! Lights out. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop for this contest at 1 minute, 23 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USC strawweight champion of the world, Felice Lil And she remains the UFC strawweight champion.
Coming up next, it's a strawweight title fight between Felice Herring and the Eraser. The Eraser, making the way to the Octagon and set to leave tonight with the UFC Strawweight Championship belt around her waist. As she makes her way to the Octagon right now, her preparation has been perfect. She is in fantastic shape, she is focused, she is motivated, and she believes she will leave this cage tonight as the new champion of the world. The Eraser steps into the Octagon, and this time, she wants to leave with the belt. She is set to enter the octagon for the last time in her professional career. Entertaining throughout the years, great battles inside the octagon. One of the most popular UFC veterans of all time. But tonight will be the last time we witness her displaying her skills inside the octagon. The champion is making her way to the cage right now. Her preparation for this title bout has been absolutely according to plan. She is focused, she is in great shape, motivated and determined to step in here and put on a championship level performance and retain her title. For our main event of the evening, the Eraser is 32, Herrick is 46. The Eraser is two inches tall. Herrick will have a one inch reach advantage. And now with our official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge, Eve Buffer. This woman is a Muay Thai fighter, holding a professional record of 14 wins, 5 losses. She stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 113 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York, introducing the challenger, the Eraser. And now introducing the champion, fighting at the red corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 33 wins, four losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, fighting at a Crystal Lake, Illinois, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Felice Lilbuco. UFC belt on the line, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. Felice Harry, Ready? the eraser. Ready? Here we go! Championship fight, five, five minute rounds. White trunks for the eraser. Black trunks for the champion. Joe, her last performance was... Look at that! Oh, oh, my! She's not down! Back up! That's Big a shot huge to left! Oh, nice feet!
big shot just missed. Oh! Big overhand. Turning into an all-out slugfest. Vicious combinations. Big connection with the elbow. That Vicious was a elbow nasty lands to the elbow. head. Big shot. She's she got cracked in the head. She's stunned. She's in trouble, yeah. Strong jab. Vicious shot to the body. Hard straight punch. Body kick, look at that. Nice takedown. Oh, that's a big strip. Quick hands. That huge head kick was blocked. The eraser with the big leg kick. There's another very nice kick. And again. The eraser oh, with oh, that's elbow. a vicious elbow. Excellent timing here. Big left hand for the victory. Time now for our fight replay. Let's see it one more time. Look at the power in this hook as it lands for the knockout. And here we see it again. Boom! And that's all she wrote. All right, here's Bruce Buffer with the decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 24 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USC strawweight champion of the world, Felice Wilbuka For years, a crowd favorite, a UFC champion. Not many people can say that they have earned a UFC belt. Not many people can say that they defended it in the final fight of their career. But that is what she has done. She will be remembered forever as one of the most entertaining champions in UFC history.